forward, push them forward through. So much better. You feel the difference? Yeah. Now do you feel like you could turn him if you wanted to? Yeah. Off your right rein or off your left rein? Yes, absolute. Look in the mirror. You're gonna see that now you're straighter. Good, and that doesn't mean that you can't now think a little bit of suppleness to the left without over positioning him. Now you have to think about how you can balance out that he stays to the left rein, but he's soft to the right. Oh yeah, good job. Really nice, Margaret, that's super. Much better. Good boy. Yeah, yeah, right rein. Yes, there you go. Yes, yes, right rein. Just, just give him the exact same feel that you did. Yay. Oh yeah. <laughs> Very nice. And forward, 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 forward. Just use your seat. Come on, push him forward, 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 forward. Come on, more. There you go. Good boy. Yeah, see? Now he came to your right rein. Yeah. That's right. Good. Forward, forward. Uh, use the short side, please. That's right. Good. Go across the diagonal. Right rein to turn him. That's all right. Good boy. Good. Back to the trot, and immediately take him to the left rein. Forward, forward. I haven't seen that, I don't think they're particularly too long. But here again, take your left rein. Again, too much right rein. Right leg, get him over there. Get him to your left rein. There you go, super. Yes. I think your left rein could be a little more upwards in his mouth. Yeah, there you go. Super. Now, and then you're going to do your right lead canter. And you're going to keep him to these aids. And careful again, don't jam him in a corner. Use your left rein more. Ride the corner off the left rein. And don't ride him quite so deep into it. So he doesn't lose his balance being too deep. Remember, you only have to do a 20 meter circle turn. That's it. Left rein, left rein, still. Supple a little bit on the left. Oh yeah. There you go. There you go. I want you to feel like, well, is he floating between the reins? Will he look a little left if I want? Will he look a little right if I want? Can I control where the shoulders go? Very nice. Super. All right, so down the long side again. Come on, let's see a really well aligned. There you go, better. Better, better. Oh, a little drifting. Just a little drifting after you got to an E. And, and do another circle down that end. Again, balance, left rein, balance, left rein. And pick up the right lead canter off of your left rein. That's it. And again, come on, forward, forward, forward. Come on, ride his shoulders bigger. Ride his shoulders bigger. Doesn't matter, left rein. Just a little soft, left rein, left rein. Go, go, go. Good boy. There. Yes, float him a little bit between your reins again. All right, that's it, come on. He could go even bigger than that, supple and left. Come on, get those shoulders better. Oh, what a good boy. Yay. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It's a little bit variable still, but it's much better than it was, huh? Yeah, I still feel like you could counter flex him a little bit to the left. Counter flex and left. Good. Shorten your reins just a little. And just make it for a minute about your reins. And just say, I want you to look a little left. I'll give you all the right and just let you look left. Good boy. Touch his neck. Super. And, for, and then ride. Ride, ride. Good. Now straighten him a little bit. He's all right. Good boy. Yes. Very nice. He gave to you really well. Now again, make him look just a hair left as he can. It's like no big deal, just look left. Good boy, touch his neck. Let him know he was good about that. Yay, there. He came to it, feel it? Yes. That's what I want him to do. Very good. And then you supple him a little bit with the right rein and just help him a little bit to realize there's a little bit of softness, a little bend this side, but you have to stay willing to move off my left rein. Every time he doesn't 
Just bring him a little left for a second. Give up your right rein until he pops into the left rein. Yeah. That's it. Very nice. Very nice. Now that you're over there, see? Very nice. Very nice. Really good, and what a nice active trot. He could be just a hair deeper to his right rein now. Hair deeper to that right rein. Yeah, good boy. Good. So that's the rein, like I said, that you have to feel the trot in. It's telling you deep, 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 the whole time, connect, connect, connect. Oh, he's, he's going to poop. That's why he's probably backing off a little bit. Yeah, good. Circle, circle down at C, and remember, ride forward and straight through your circle. Just ride the alignment of a circle now. So his shoulders have to do the circle, and he needs some, he needs some uh, suppleness to the inside. Okay, there you counter flex him. Keep going. Come on. You're probably overdoing a little bit. Again, you're trying to strong arm him a little bit. Just ride him around it. There. Thank you. See what I mean? Don't overdo. He doesn't need that much overdo. Yes! Very good. Very good. Good, good. All right. So again, take a circle. And let's pick up the canter on a circle. But again, pick a moment when you feel he's good. Get up to the right rein. And you feel he's forward and good. So it's a forward transition. Good. There. Yes, you're ready. Go. Yes. Go. Now forward. Forward. Right rein. Counter flex if you need to. Just hang in there with it for a minute. And let him know it's good boy. When he gives to the right. Good boy, yes. There you go. Now you can add your left rein, a little suppleness. If he balks to it, take it back to the right rein. Oh, he's okay. There you go. All right, and, and if you need to put your, your left leg a little further back to help him. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Feel it? Then you can do that for a second. You don't have to carry it that way the whole time, but if it helps, you know, to get him to the right rein better, then that's fine. 